Not up to speed. Understanding this common English phrase. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a very common phrase in English. Not up to speed. This phrase is often used in everyday conversations and professional settings, so understanding its meaning and usage is crucial for effective communication. Let's dive in and get up to speed with this phrase. The phrase, not up to speed, generally means not having the latest information or knowledge about a particular topic or not being fully competent in a certain area. It's often used in situations where there's a need to catch up with others or with recent developments. For example, if you've been away from work for a while, you might not be up to speed on the latest project updates. Interestingly, the phrase, up to speed, has its roots in the early days of machinery and automobiles. When machines or vehicles reached their optimal operating speed, they were said to be up to speed. Over time, this term evolved to mean being current or knowledgeable in a broader sense, not just in a mechanical context. To better understand how to use not up to speed, let's look at some examples. I just returned from vacation, so I'm not up to speed on the latest office news. Our new team member is still not up to speed with our workflow, but she's learning quickly. There are several other phrases and words with similar meanings that you can use. Out of the loop, behind the times, uninformed, unacquainted. That's all for our exploration of the phrase, not up to speed. I hope this video has brought you up to speed on its meaning and usage. Remember, Language learning is a journey, so don't worry if you're not up to speed on everything at once. Keep practicing, and you'll get there. See you in our next video.